Now this video is going to talk about how to cast from your desktop if you're going to show a video or something like that to this to your new line RS plus board. So the first thing you're going to do is uh, I'll go to displaynote.com join, which will be on the board when you open up the casting session. Now when you get here, there's a couple of things that you want to make sure that you do. You can share you can share your screen directly from this web-based portal by putting in your session ID that would be on your display note board and putting in your name. But if you do this, you do not get any audio. So if you're going to have a DVD or something that you wanted to play from your computer, you definitely want to scroll down just a little bit and you're going to download the display note for your device. So this is going to be for Windows and we're going to download the display note for your device. And this is what you want to have the Display Note app on your Windows machine if you're going to share audio from if you're going to share audio from your uh, desktop watching a DVD player. So I've already done that. So if I close this out, you'll see that we have the Display Note app that's already been installed. And when you open this app up, you're going to enter in your session ID, which will always be on the board and you're going to put in your name and i'm going to hit the connect button now one of the things that you might notice is depending on how you are doing this i, I would always recommend you start at the highest quality so you get the best that you can get but if you if you see that there's you're having some quality issues or having some problems you may need to change now you can see in the web the um um embedded camera in the corner we've got the display note board is up there I have moderator mode turned off, so I should be able to just go right in and share my screen. When I go to share my screen, you can see that it's pulled up, but you notice that there's black bars on either side of it. The reason for that is that your Windows desktop has a square monitor, what's known as 4-3 orientation. So your board will present your screen in the same manner. So you won't get the full widescreen theater view because your desktop computer monitor is a 4.3 monitor. From here, we would just simply open up our VLC media player on our desktop. I would go in to play my video. And this will give you the audio. And you can control the audio on your DVD um from the screen and you can watch your videos by casting them directly from your desktop at the at the classroom table and this is how you would share a dvd with your new line rs board